What are several hundreds of delicious Austrian wines doing in San Francisco's Fort Mason? Welcome to Wine Dine TV. I am Judith and I'm Karina. Come behind the label with us to the Austria Uncorked event and find out. There are going to be over 80 Austrian wineries represented here and we're really excited to start trying them. I think I what? want sect. I want sec too. <laughs> I think you need this pin. In German language called the sparkling wine sect. And this is Sigeti, which is actually like a Hungarian sounding name. And they do have wonderful sparkling wines here. Hello. Hello. How are you? Fine, thank you. We want sect. We want sect. Sparkling <laughs> Berliner. That's amazing! Grüne Weltliner in sparkling wine. And how many different varieties do you have of sect here? Well, here in the United States we have three different varieties, but in Austria we have more than 25 different varieties. I already smelling the microphone too. <laughs> I'm getting stone fruit, a little bit of honey. It's a drier sect. Yes. It doesn't come out right away. It's taking a little bit of time for the flavors to develop for me, but I'm getting a bit of toastiness also on this, kind of that a bit of vanilla too. What and I've a little bit of bitterness. Do you taste a tiny bit of bitterness, which is quite nice, it's different. I think it's from the soil, like kind of the chalky soil. Mm -hmm. It's minerally a bit. Yeah, very nice. There's some complex flavors going on in the back of my tongue. I'm still thinking about it. It's a very interesting wine because it, it's first you think it's a, a very light with, with not too much elements and as you have it in your mouth and warming up. Like a, I'm getting a bit of like the Werther's original candies actually. A mm. bit of that um, like a buttery toffee type of flavor candy. And I'm getting like I would eat a peach and I would suck a little bit on the peach stone. A little bit, you know, like it's getting bitter. I'm gonna stick to my candy. Ah! <laughs> All right, but well, let's see what Try else. Another one. Another sect. I'm the marketing and sales manager. The winemaker is my brother Norbert. He's at home. I hope working. And to making more sect. Yeah, to make him more sect. And I have the pleasure to be here in the beautiful California and San Francisco. Wonderful. Do you have a Heurige? No, we not have a Heurige, but we have two wine bars in Vienna. Yeah. One is near the Naschmarkt and one is in the center of Vienna, where we serve all our sparkling wines, where you can taste more than 30 different sparkling wines by glass. That sounds exciting because we are planning a tourist group to come to Vienna and enjoy the Viennese wine region. So we hope we can have some sec too. You hear it? We're going to have a lot of sec there. 30? 30 varietals. Which one is the next one to try here? We have to the make our one. dent on the 30. The next one is the Rosé Brut, which is a full body Rosé. The Cuvée is made from Zweigel and Blaufränkisch, the typical Austrian grapes. The typical Cuvée means uh, one part of Chardonnay, one part of Pinot Blanc, and the Blanc de Noir, the red part, is the Austrian Blaufränkisch. So this is a wonderful, nice taste and it's uh, one year longer in the bottle on the yeast. So it's more the international taste and the Vetlina has more the young and fresh typical Austrian taste. So I'm going to try the rosé. And I guess we're going to move aside so another champagne lover can enjoy this beautiful table. So I'm getting melon on this, um, I'm getting a little tiny bit of citrus, peach, and it's got a beautiful like salmon color. May we ask you, what was your favorite here? At this point, the sect. Sect. The Grüne Baltina. There are so many wonderful varietals, isn't it a surprise? It's just amazing. Cheers. 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 And please tell us, what are you doing? How many bottles a year? So we make more or less one million bottles uh, wow. per year <laughs> uh, in, in 30 different uh, grape varieties. And when you come to our wine cellar, you can visit all the, the departments from the to, to bottling, 
until to move the bottles and, and to disgorge the bottles as well as my brother will open one bottle with the knife. Oh, in the savory. old French tradition. How did you end up with 30 Hoya items? Every year we discovered that sparkling wine in Austria, uh, many years ago, was only made by the Grüner Wettliner in Welsh Riesling. And then we tried to make a Muscat Ottonel, a very fruity, flavory sparkling wine. And it was, uh, was one of the best sellers. And then we made the Rosé Brut, which is mm -hmm. a cuvée. Then we made the Rosé by Pinot Noir, and then mm -hmm. the Neuburg, and then the Pinot Blanc. Wow. And so the family of, of sparkling wine was growing and growing on. And now we have more than 30 different brick varieties. Well, that's exciting. And I still have to decide which one I love. And I tasted already three of you varietals, and I love them all. Not because you're standing here, but it's really a very nice sparkling wine. Very nice Thank scent. you very much. It has body to it. It's not overpowering. It doesn't try to be something because it has to be. You let the wine try to tell you what it should be, correct? Because we work, the, the, the first work which we do is in the wine yard. Right. Yes. And we only use the, the healthy grapes, matured grapes, uh, uh, because we have in Burgenland in our region the most sunny days. And then uh, the, the vinification is made by my brother. Uh, Your brother, what is his name? Norbert. Norbert, Norbert Sigeti. Sigeti, yes. And He's you are? Peter. Peter and Norbert Sigeti. No, but he is the worker, he is producing. And he's talking wonderful. The brother, <laughs> you need to work and you drink, right? You try it. Well, that's a family business yes. and that yeah. is all about. Yes. You know, it's yeah. wonderful. We are really excited to meet you today here and your sparkly sect will be with us for a while oh, yes, because it's wonderful. We, wonderful. Thank you very much and I hope I will see you as soon as possible in Austria. Yes, yes. we will be coming and bring your durs with you because 30 varietals. That's a lot. Thank you very Thank you. much. Auf Wiedersehen. 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 And I want more sex. <laughs> <laughs>